Code Breakers, the makers of modern genetics, is a project by the Wellcome Library to put online over one and a half million pages of books and archives that trace the story of genetics from the middle of the 19th century to the end of the 20th century, a period that transformed our understanding of how genes influence our lives. This is going to be the first of what we hope are many projects like this, spearheaded by the Wellcome Library, digitising not just our collections but also those of partner institutions, creating an unparalleled resource for the study of biomedical science, medicine and health. The history of genetics is important to the Trust, really because of the story of genetics and then the promise that it brings ultimately. So the story is something that we want to tell, from the unravelling of the code, from the sequencing of the code, to understanding the science of the code, and now where we are on the brink of great promise for future health, which is what the Trust is all about. One of the things I love about the archives we've digitised is the way in which they reveal everything from some really iconic objects to things that give you an unexpected insight into the personal lives of scientists. So for example we've got Francis Crick's sketches trying to elucidate the structure of DNA. We have photograph 51, the key X-ray diffraction image taken by Raymond Gosling when he was working for Rosalind Franklin that provided a key clue in deciphering the structure of DNA. The archives we've digitised go way beyond just the story of DNA though. We have the papers of the Eugenics Society with these wonderful family trees tracing the heredity of gifted families, not just of intellectual geniuses, but also skilled craftspeople, revealing this intense desire to understand the nature of heredity in the early 20th century. It's been a three-year project, one that's required us not just to scan, to digitise all of this material, but also to develop the mechanism for storing it all and for delivering it to our users, creating a new digital player that allows researchers to access all of this content, to download it, to use it wherever they are in the world. This wouldn't have been possible without the support of our partners. University College London, King's College London, Cold Spring Harbour Laboratory in the United States, Glasgow University Library and Churchill College Cambridge, their archive centre. We've worked with them to digitise what they hold and to bring that together with our collections to create what we hope is a really rich and useful resource. One of the key focus areas of the Trust is actually to understand medicine and science in its broadest cultural and historical context. What Codebreakers does is it takes all of the history, it takes it from looking at the science, looking at the scientists, but also looking at the impact on society, and it puts that out there for the public, for scholars, for students, for the future. <laughs>